look at the following. We have a brief introduction. We'll look at how to convert a percentage to a fraction. We'll look at how to convert a fraction to a percentage. And finally, we'll look at how to convert a decimal to a percentage. So let's look at the definitions of each. So what is a percentage? A percentage is a number or a ratio expressed as a fraction of 100. It is often denoted using the percentage sign. So that's the percentage sign. So an example of a percentage is 45%. Then what is a decimal? So a decimal number can be defined as a number that is separated by a decimal point. Example, 0 0.34. Then what is a fraction? So a fraction represents a part of any number of equal parts. Example, 1 over 2. All right, so let's look at how to convert a percentage into a fraction. So when converting a percentage to a fraction, we divide uh, the number by 100 and remove the percentage sign. So for example, question number one, express 4% as a fraction in its lowest term. So 4%, so we have to divide it over 100. So we'll say 4 over 100, and then once we divide this, we should get the percentage. So 4 into 4 goes one time, and then 4 into 100 goes 25 times. So that's the answer. So we've converted it from 4%, a percentage, into a fraction, which is 1 over 25. And then question number two, express 28% as a fraction in its lowest term. So we use the same procedure. We write 28 over 100, and then we reduce it to its lowest term. So 2 into 28 goes 14 times, and then 2 into 100 goes 50 times. So that's the next step. 14 over 50. We can reduce this further. So 2 into 14 goes 7 times, and then 2 into 50 goes 25 times. So the final answer is 7 over 25. So we've converted 28% into a fraction. Let's look at how to convert a fraction to a percentage. So we're converting a fraction to a percentage, we multiply by 100%. So we do the opposite. So let's look at some examples. Express 1 over 2 as a percentage. So 1 over 2 is a fraction. Let's convert it to a percentage. So we write 1 over 2 times 100%. So 1 over 2 times 100 is 50. So that's 50%. Another example is express 2 over 5 as a percentage. So use the same procedure. Write the fraction 2 over 5, then multiply it by 100. Then we can say 5 into 100 goes 20 times. So we're going to say 2 times 20, which is 40. So the final answer is 40%. So remember, when converting a fraction to percentage, we multiply the fraction by 100%. Finally, let's look at how to convert a decimal to a percentage. So when converting a decimal to a percentage, shift two decimal places to the right by multiplying by 100. So you shift the decimal point two places to the right by multiplying by 100. Let's look at some examples. Express 0 0.25 as a percentage. So we shift the decimal point to the right. So that's 1, 2, twice. So we get... 0 0.25 times 100 so when multiplying times 100 we shift the decimal point to the right twice so we're going to get 25 percent because the decimal point is going to move from here it's going to come 2.5 finally 25 so that's the final answer another example is express 0 0.0313 as a percentage so again we multiply this by 100 then we shift the decimal point twice to the right so when you do that, we're going to get 3.13% because the decimal point is here. When you move it twice to the right, 1, 2, then you want to get 3.13%. All right, so that concludes this short topic on percentages, decimals, and fractions. Just make sure you practice a lot and remember how to convert from decimal to percentage, from percentage to fraction, and from fraction to percentage.